They say art is very personal, and that couldn't be more true for one Saskatchewan teen who taught her horse how to paint. As Carla Shinkerick found out, the close bond the pair shares resulted in some beautiful art, and that is straight from the horse's mouth. You want. This is Tuff the horse. Many of his days here at the stable involve training and choosing paint colors. Yellow or purple? Both? Ella Wall helps take care of Tuff, and after seeing a trend on TikTok where horses use their snout or tongue to paint, she was intrigued. And I was like, hey, that seems cool. So I went to the dollar store and picked up some canvases, and I just you know, wanted to see if he'd like it. And not only does he like it. If I get out the paint bottles, he'll put his ears forwards and he'll get excited. Tuff was given Catalina oil to help with a leg injury he got from his life as a thoroughbred racehorse. They discovered he liked the oil, so that's what's on the plastic cover. The bond that these two share is very unique. Wall has Tourette's syndrome. Sometimes she can't well, speak. Usually he's the one that gets me to talk again. There's just something that switches when I see him. He has a very unique personality, according to the stable owner, which may contribute yeah. to his artistry. He's very um, obvious when he likes and doesn't like something. He'll paw, he'll bob his head, he'll do this lip thing. The lip will just <laughs> vibrate, and he'll do kind of weird, quirky things. So Tuff's works of art are for sale on his Facebook page for $25 and $50, and all money raised goes right back to Tuff's care. And we put it into a bank account for him, so if he needs a chiropractor or another joint injection, he can get that right away. Without Wall now trains Tuff in Liberty Method. That means all control comes from commands and no reins. A far cry from his controlled racehorse life, allowing him a bit more freedom just to horse around. <sighs> Carla Shinkarook, CTV News, near Borden.